In this video, I am going to show you how to set up successfully contact 7 from submission as a lead for Facebook Pixels. As you can see, this is my demo WordPress website and my contact 7 from already embed with this website. So I just click and this is my form and I want to track it for Facebook Pixel leads. You can see my website is still not connected with Facebook Pixel. And now I am going to set up it. I will use Google Tag Manager to set up my conversion tracking because this is the smart and easy way to set up conversion tracking like Google Analytics, Google Ads, Facebook Ads, etc. If you are not so technical, you can contact me. I am here to help you. Details on the description. Let's back here. First of all, go to Google Tag Manager account and you need to connect to Google Tag Manager container to website and then you need to go on the preview mode because we need to find a unique event. So for now I am going to click on preview and I will input my website URL and try to connect. You can see my website is opening on the preview mode. It's you can see you can tell it's a test mode. Okay. You can see my website is connected. Now go to contact 7 form page so you can see this is the form page and you can see here is no any unique event because i didn't submit any form here so just and get consult so our form is submitted and now let's go back the tag assistant and you can see the cf7 submission is the unique event that we need to send to our facebook pixel so for sending facebook pixel event we need to make a trigger so i just click on new and try to make uh, the facebook pixel trigger so if you can't see pixel here just download it from their template gallery so i already downloaded so you can see this is the pixels and we need to input here our basic pixel code so we actually have to make the two pig uh, uh, two tag for sending exact event because one for page view it is the basic connection to our website and facebook pixel so you can see this is the all page and page view i just save it and then we need to make the another uh, pixel for sending the custom event so i'm clicking new and try to find same templates and input the same uh, pixel id and here you can see i just select the lead it's actually the lived event and now it's time to make a trigger you can see uh, the cf7 form is here so i am going to show you how to how you can make it so select custom event and choose the exact same name that you uh, got from your a custom event in your tag assistant so i already did that so that's why i am just selecting it okay so it's done now it's time to save so click on save and you can uh, if you want you can rename it so i just want facebook pixel and lead and then hit the save button and you can see my two pixels tag is uh, ready so now let's go on the pv mode again and see what actually happened so you can see this tag is connecting to my website again and uh, you can see it's loading and it's yeah it's successfully connected and now let's do the same event again so just form fill up the form and hit the consult and you can see it successfully submitted and now here is the lead and page view the two event is here so that's mean it's working fine so if you want to uh, activate this form you can see the lead image is fired only when the uh, cf7 is coming so otherwise it uh, won't send the any lead event so that's mean it will be pretty accurate if you need my assist open my calendar link and book a 15 minute free pre-project call with your date and time and then fill up a little steps i would love to assist you if you think this video was useful then hit the thumbs up because it helps me to continue working on this channel and if you want to see more video from me then consider subscribing to this channel my name is nasim and i will see you on the next video till then bye have a good day